battery on the cob, my favorite. Ah. Oh, my batteries are flat. Clippy! Oh, Clippy, that's me. Yes, sir, here I come. Whoa! You called on Michele? You telling me what you see here? Hey? Oh, yeah, it's an empty plate, sir. Exactly. Now you fill it with spaghetti cables and bring it to me and make me happy, okay? Yes, sir, you have them in a jiffy. Oh. 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 Calm down, Megahertz. Clip is the fastest and most helpful. Mm, clip on microphone errand boy we've had. How about a bomb bomb, beautiful? Yeah. Ah, mmm. Yeah. MC Megahertz ain't no chap. I'm moving my feet to the battery candy wrap. Oh! Ah. What is this, Megahertz? You think that you run out of the disco? Now turn that thing off and get back to work! You'd better leave, Megahertz. He has his cables in a twist. As usual, he's a permanent mix of crossed wires and blown fuses, you know what I mean? Where's Mick? Decibel, call him and tell him if he don't come in a five minutes, he's fired! Come along, Mick. Don't let me down. Hello, everyone. How's it all going? Oh. I'm not late, am I? Hey? Hey? You almost missed your deadline. Sports news is on in 20 minutes. We now have a story from you yet. Uh, there you are. Well, why not take a look? All right. Better be good. Not bad, eh? All right. Well, I must be off, all right? But you only just arrived here. I'm on another wait, story. Wait. I've got to run. I'm going to Crete. See you later, then. Bye. OK. See you later, Mick. Someday I'm going to be a great sports reporter just like him. Your spaghetti cable, sir. Ah. Ah. Mm, I didn't want to wear it. <sniffs> Tastes OK. You want to try a bit, Clippy? We're almost there, Mick. The coast of Crete. I told you we'd get there fast in this boat. As a Cretan, I'm no Cretan. <laughs> Aye, but I'd have preferred something with an outboard motor instead of a giant octopus. Let's kick in the turbo. Whoa! 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 Hey! Hey! Whoa! How do we stop? Crete, 2000 BC, famous for the legend of the Minotaur. I just got to take the bull by the horns and find a way out. Amazing, huh? A monster with the body of a man and the head of a bull trapped in a complicated maze from which he couldn't escape. No, I know what they mean by a bulldozer. I'm tired of this bull. I shall find another way out. Aye, well, legends aside, the bull did play an important part in Cretan society. One of the most popular events was the Bullathon. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, brave young men are going to leap into this ring and try and grab the bull by its horns and ride on its back. Oh! oh. oh. Uh. I can't take the bull by the horn. And now Manolito the Marvelous will attempt to tame the bull, and goodness gracious, what a wonderful show we're watching. How did I get involved in this? <laughs> Manolitos! Dry yourself off! Look <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Manolitos! Oh. <laughs> The bull is coming! Whoa! Manole! Manole! Manole indeed! What a move, Ole! Aye, aye! Ho ho! performance from this brave young Cretan, the unbelievable Manolitos. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it was easy, huh? Manolitos didn't know that others would follow his example in later centuries. 
Crete was already a beautiful city back then, a mixture of sumptuous palaces and quiet neighborhoods. Huh? Hey! Get out of here, you flea and muggy, before I catch you and turn you into a handbag! Its citizens lived in peace and harmony, with no more problems than those of ordinary, everyday life. Oh, look at those cute little minotaurs, Gori. Now, Gori, will you please just keep still? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Boo, no, Boo, Gori, Boo. stop it. Don't be naughty, dear. Ooh. As you can imagine, sometimes these normal, everyday situations became a little complicated. I'm moving, I'm moving. We're going as fast as we can, Mr. Cretinas. We've been very lucky with the traffic. Ah, excellent. 200 talents? <laughs> you should tell your men to move it. Shouldn't you be grinding an organ somewhere? Where have I seen that face before? Oh, it's Mac's ancestor. Yeah! That's right, Mac. Allow me to introduce Don't Mac Decree, an outstanding traffic right. policeman. He refereed in his spare time and was a master whistler. Such a smooth journey. Huh? Hey, hey hold stop. on! Hey, hey, hold it! Yeah. Oh, why do these extraordinary things happen to me? Because you're always in the wrong place, Mick. Well, now, this cab looks cheaper. I'll take it. But this isn't your taxi, sir. Uh, it oh. is now! <laughs> hey, taxi! I mean, my Hey, who's taxi. gonna pay the fare? <laughs> these humans are nuts! Cretans had a particular fascination for games. The nobility, and especially the Morans, enjoyed playing chess, for example. Your move, Festus. Uh, mate. Hmm. Ah! Oh! Oh! Mino, you moggy, how dare you interrupt a royal chess game like this? But he can't run away! Get off! If I get my hands on you, I'll make you into a... Uh... Man, it's not very often a knight can see off a queen. <laughs> but the most exciting game for Cretans by far was football. Oh, and their players oh, developed some incredible oh. abilities. The techniques of their players were so highly developed that fouls were a rarity. In fact, their football code didn't even mention fouls. And their greatest star was a young player called Toro Minus, thought to be a true footballing magician. Muffleboard microphones, he's brilliant! <laughs> but things were soon to change drastically. Spindle legs here will help to test your defence. Yes, thank you. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, maybe we should leave this to another day, right? I'll be off then. Ah. Yeah. I'm going to give you something that you may find useful in the future. All you have to do is to dribble past by Santius and the others and scroll past into um, Nebulus. OK, here goes. The nefarious Athleticus team developed their own style. Their defensive system was, shall we say, somewhat destructive. Great defending. See what I mean? That string bean didn't last a minute and I was only just getting warmed up. <laughs> Here, I think you better open this now. Uh, oh, a present. You do care. Oh. I said you'd find it useful. I'd keep it handy for after training if I were you. <laughs> Cretans demonstrated their enthusiasm for football by filling the stadium game after game. Oh, ah! oh, uh, oh, oh, phew, what a fright! Uh, ah! Oh, have we met? What an atmosphere this place has! Huh? Ah! The lack of rules to penalize fouls now became something of a problem. Could have put my foot down! Oh, now stop that, my Sartius! Pardon me, my error! Step this out! He isn't a footballer, he's just a shin kicker. I'm sorry, but the regulations say nothing about that being a foul, Taurus. Great ball! Ah! That was a dive. The spectators soon got tired of seeing foul after foul instead of skillful play and lots of goal-mouth incident. 
They can't argue with Joe Public. They're voting with their feet at this fiesta of foul play. Football should be a clean sport. Those nefarious players don't know how to play football. Cool, is right there. We can't take two steps with the ball before we get clattered. Crikey, this is a disgrace. He's right, Riff. I understand, lads, and I sympathise with you. I'll think of something to solve this problem. Mac Decree solved the problem immediately and made new rules to encourage fair play. Mac Decree, new regulations governing fouls and free kicks are to be introduced to the game on Saturday. The stadium was full of spectators for the first game incorporating the new rules. Oh, 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 oh! Yeah. Stadium, it's against the rules. Well, we wouldn't want to break the rules. Oh, I don't, I don't, I don't, don't like that touch paper, it'll go off. I don't... Oh. Oh. Hey, Harry, no smoking. Like this, Guri? No, no, Guri, you want to play? Hey, come on! Oh, it's Menelitos. I didn't know you liked football. Sure. But I can't see past Fatso. <laughs> yeah! Ah, hey. I got a goal! Spectators were also ready to try new ways of putting excitement into the proceedings during slow periods of play. And so the wave was born. A direct or indirect free kick will be awarded to the opposing team if a player commits any foul. Understand? Yeah, got it. Right. Here is my oh boy. <laughs> That whistle's the start of the game, Crete tonight. Shift yourself. Uh, oh. oh! That's cool. Oh, 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 oh! oh. Foul! Free kick to the Triana. Go on, Corpulentus. I reckon you can stick it straight into the back of the net from there. Uh, can I score a goal from the kick, then? Only if it touches another player. So you've got to hold your hand up until the ball comes back and hits another player. Unfortunately, hey. it's in the rules of the game. Oh, I just thought you wanted to leave the pitch. Aha! Oh! Okay, red leader. Now some airplane football are over the moon again. Oh, he kicked it straight in the net. The ball hit you first, so the goal stands. Don't let them near their goal, you halfwits. Chop them down. Take their legs. Good goal, lads. That should teach these hooligans to play fair. The new rules made it possible for goals to be scored from free kicks. Mm. Not this time. Ow! What's the matter with thee? Touch your crumb. A direct free kick for a serious foul. A direct free kick? That's not fair. What is a direct free kick? It means the player taking the free kick can score directly without the ball having to touch another player first. It's in the rules of the game. Oh, that's not fair. I can't kick it through a sunlight, John. You couldn't kick it through a paper bag. And all the players on the opposing team must be at least 9.15 metres from the ball. Any wall that they may want to form will be made over here at the same distance away. Line up and make a wall! Mr. Cretinus wants us to make the wall. <laughs> Anyone know what he's talking about? Yeah, I know. <whistles> uh. No! <laughs> Good wall! Uh-oh. Idiots, I said line up and make a wall, not stand in single file. Well, we always line up like that at school. Oh, are you? What are you looking at? Get Get oh, it leaves up for me! He's mine! To me, by Sontius, I'll take lots of them on. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I didn't see you down there. Penalty! No penalty, even though it's inside the area. It's a less serious offence, so it's an indirect free kick. This'll do. Oh, crikey! <laughs> Sorry, Vicentius, but you can't take the kick inside this small area, even though the foul was committed there. You have to take it from outside this line when an indirect free kick is given in the other team's goal area. It don't matter. The ball's so close, they're going to have to make the wall behind the goal Wrong line. again, Vicentius. When the goal line is less than 9.15 metres away, they can make their wall on that. Fine. All the worse for them. Huh? Oh, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I think he missed.
hits me. to cheer your team peacefully and to encourage fair play. You want to see some more stars, Well, <laughs> <laughs> No, thanks. <laughs> but... Uh... I can fully recommend the ride. <laughs> oh. <laughs> OK, Will, I think we've had enough of fireworks. They're not bad lads, really. Just misunderstood. Clumsy. Yeah. Uh, right, uh, uh, right. Come here. Stop what? this. Sorry. No! <laughs> yeah. Huh? Yeah. Hey, hey, well. Incompetent idiots. No go. That geezer didn't wait for us to make the wall. As long as the ball stopped and placed where the foul was made, the player may take a free You're kick as soon as he liked. <laughs> OK, half time. Yay! Hot the ball! If they get any more free kicks, make them miss. Do you think you can manage that? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, you can't just kick us off the park. <whistles> what? Any player leaving the wall before the kick's taken will be cautioned. If they all do it, the first one's booked. Move out too soon again, you may be off. <whistles> I told you you can't leave the wall until the kick's been taken. Come on, ref! You're playing like a bunch of old women! <laughs> you didn't have to glue me feet to pitch. Zippy! Black Bull Energy Drink, get your Black Bull and be as strong as an ox! Hey, wow, I'm thirsty! Time for a pit stop! Three, please! <laughs> Twelve talents, oh, please! Oh, sure, the guy behind me is paying. Behind me! Mm. <laughs> Come on, you stupid boy! Come on, distract him! Don't just stand there! Distract him? Oh, hey, I've got an idea. You like this? Nice outfits. I wonder if that could be their away strip. <laughs> huh? Anyone distracting a player taking a free kick will be cautioned. No goal. It's disallowed because a player cannot score an own goal from his free kick. The goal isn't valid and the game resumes with a corner kick to the opposing team. It's in the rules of the game, lads, so let's just get on with it, shall we? I'm sick and tired of all these rules. Football's a man's game, so why can't we play it like we used to play it? Oh! Move, Blonde. Oh. <laughs> no goal and a direct free kick to the triad. All right, let's go. No goal? How are we supposed to score if we can't even touch the opponents? I ask you, this is stupid. Yeah. A foul against the defending team in their own goal area results in a free kick taken from anywhere within that area. It's in the rules of the game, by Santias. You'd be able to read it for yourself if you could read, laddie. OK, I'll stand the right distance away and see if he misses. If it's inside the area, opponents must be outside it. Oh, I know, it's in the rules of the game. Oh, hey, hey, hey. hey, come on, he touched the ball twice before anyone else touched it. That has to be a foul, right? Not so, laddie. When a free kick is taken inside one's own penalty area, only the player taking that free kick may kick the ball more than once to clear the area. It's in the rules of the game. <laughs> hey, to you, Taurus. <laughs> Sorry. Hey! 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 Hey
William gonna oh. lost us the game! You losers played like a herd of cattle! Oh no, I didn't mean it! The game appears to be over. How exciting your move, dear. So Triada FC gave Nefarious Athleticus a lesson in fair play. Commit too many fouls and you can see too many goals. Right. What amazing ball control. This boy's a genius. He's broken the world record for keeping up. He's all on his own. Oh! Uh, what was that you were saying about free kicks? Go on. There are two types of free kick. The direct free kick and the oh. indirect. Let's take the direct free kick first. A player can score without the ball having to touch anyone else. Uh, so a direct free kick's a little bit like a penalty then, Aye, you say? I suppose so, more or less. With an indirect free kick, at least two players have to touch the ball before it goes into the net, or it's no goal. But the opposing team can make a wall and try and stop it, can't they? Aye, but the wall must be at least 9.15 metres away from the ball. Right, I've got that back. Now I've got to go and see a man about a microphone, so I'll see you later then, OK? Where are you off to so fast, Mick? We haven't finished. Haven't we? Uh, for example, if an indirect free kick bounces off the wall and goes into the net, it's a valid goal. Uh, you see? Very interesting. <coughs> All right. That's enough for today. Now, will you come down off that lamp and stop acting like Tarzan? <coughs> <coughs>